the B A B A L E. Yes, that's the book for me. I stand alone on the word of God, the B A B A L E. Hi, Thomas. Hi, Rhonda. Oh, what's wrong, Thomas? You look confused. I am confused. What has you so confused? Would you like to talk about it? I'm so confused. I don't know what I should do. Why don't you tell me about it? Maybe I can help. Well, my mum just baked some delicious chocolate chip cookies. Oh, chocolate chip cookies are my favorite. Can I come over to your house? <gasps> wait, wait. Chocolate chip cookies, why does that make you confused? Well, my mum only let me eat one and said I couldn't have another one until after dinner tonight. That's hours away. Aww. But my brother says I can just sneak into the kitchen and take as many as I want from the cookie jar. Oh my, what are you going to do? I'm not sure. Stealing feels like the wrong thing to do. But is it? I'm just not sure. Those cookies are so delicious. Well, Thomas, I think the Bible can help you on this one. The Bible is God's word, right? That's right. So we can trust what the Bible says is true. Really? Well, you see, there was a man in the Bible named Moses. He was the leader of God's people. God's people were confused about what was right and wrong. So God gave them the Ten Commandments. The Ten Commandments? Yes, the Ten Commandments. That's a list of ten rules to live a good life. Ten of God's yeses and no's. Should we go through it? Number one. Yeah. Yes to loving God. Yes to loving your mum and dad. No to lying. No to stealing. Huh. I guess that's my answer. If I want to live in God's way, I won't steal. I'm proud of you, Thomas. I never knew I could find the answers to my questions in the Bible. Thanks, Jesus. And thanks, Moses. Thanks for telling me, Rhonda. Can we keep reading the Bible together? Of course we can. It sounds like fun. <laughs>